before the video starts, I would like to say that for some reason I've become more active on Instagram and TikTok. If you guys want to follow me there at Dennis Weistrom, then please do that. And let's get on with the video. Hey everyone, it's me Dennis. So I woke up to some sad news today. So as you guys know, I was gone for almost two months in the US. So I was kind of like completely fallen off the planet. Like I had no idea what was going on with Star Stable. And I come back and I find out that the Generation 2 Quarter Horses are retiring on August 17th. And like, you don't understand, when I joined this game, I did not hop on a starter horse. I was literally mounted on a freaking generation two quarter horse. Okay, like I, that is my childhood. Those horses are my childhood. Whenever I think of Star Stable in 2015, when I joined the game, I think of those quarter horses. I freaking, look at it, look at a rat, okay? Like it looks like a freaking disgusting rat, but to me, to me it's more than a disgusting little rat. To me it's a little dingy rat. So I rode those quarter horses for like 4 years straight. Like I think all my generation 2 quarter horses from my home stable have scoliosis at this point. Okay, like I rode those rats non-stop. I would race all the time, so I'm freaking... My first Star Stable video was of this quarter horse and it was a music video and I'm not gonna play the song because I don't want to get copyrighted. And then um, I also recorded a Fort Panther Champ, Shortcuts, whatever. And then, like, the, all the videos, all the videos were of me riding a quarter horse, just proving a point. I lived on these horses. When I tell you that I used to make shortcut videos, I was not joking. Like, I was into racing, I was a big fan of racing. And these horses, for some reason, were so good for that, for racing. They were amazing. Hey everybody, it's me, Crazy Horse here, and this is the first time I'm using my voice, which will be kind of awkward or weird. Alright, that is enough. Enough with the chipmunk boys. So I am so sad that they're removing them from the game. And yes, you guessed it, I'm gonna go buy them. And I don't wanna hear it. Okay, I see you rolling your eyes at me. I know, they look like disgusting rats, but they're nice to me. To me, they're like... The core of Star Stable, okay? Like, when I think of Star Stable, it's Generation 2 Quarter Horses racing all the time. Getting all those juicy shortcuts, I'm never seeing that again. And so, the fact that they're removing them from the game, it's like... You'll need help, Star Stable. Also, this horse is really nice. I thought I would hate the Welsh ponies. Did I call them Welsh ponies again? Are they? They're hufflingers. Dude, I literally posted a video buying this horse. And I, in the title, I said buying the new Welsh ponies. And you guys made sure to roast me in the comments. And I love that. I love that about you guys. Okay, so here's the black one that I already own, as one would imagine. This one. Do I already have all of them? Like, what is the point of this video? I thought I didn't have as many. Um, so I have this one, which is my first horse ever from the game. Um, and then there's this one that I really, really like. Dude, I know they look disgusting. Like, I know they're so funky. Like, what is this body? Right? Like, I know they're horrific. But to me, the meaning behind them and the memories are more important than the actual horse. This looks so bad. And I remember when I thought it looked so good. <laughs> it's so funny to me now. <laughs> Okay, so this one, I'm not emotionally attached to it at all because I never had this horse, actually. I had it on a different account that I never was on. This horse, again, I never had in, on any accounts. Um, this one I did have, so I might have to get it back. And then this one I never had, and neither this one. So I think I'll be getting... Wait, are they also removing the paint horses? Bro, if they're removing the paint horses, then it's game over. Like these ones. Do I have this one? I do. Okay, good. Do I have this one? I don't. Okay, I'm afraid they're gonna remove these ones too, pretty soon. So I'll need to buy all of these before they they leave. Okay, maybe not this one. This one is... I always dislike this one. Like, this one is a freaking carrot. Alright, so Star Stable has not said anything about removing the paint horses yet. However, I'm pretty sure they'll do that because we have the new ones in the game. Alright, let's buy this one and then this one. I'll start with this one because this one I actually had on my other account that got banned because I'm dumb. On my first account, Denise Youngstorm that got banned, so I need this one back. I'll just name it Strawberry, and we'll make it a a mare. Adult. Actually looks really young. They all look so young. The faces are so funny to me. Oh man, I can't believe I'm buying these horses. Like, I know they look horrific, but I just... I'm so afraid that if I don't get them now, I will be regretting not getting them i'll be like why did i not buy these horses they were like my childhood and now they're gone forever so yeah dude it's so funny like it's so cool to see how star stable is progressing so much with coats like if you look at the blue roan here what the heck are those speckles what is that and then this one too it's so metallic and i could make a better job in photoshop or like in paint okay maybe not in paint 
but like I'm just saying how much they evolved and it's so cool to see the progress and then this one this one is a pretty cool one man I'm gonna get bullied I'm gonna get so bullied and I know that and that's fine because I'm saying these horses are cool and like what the heck is that face you know what I mean browse breeds this is amazing wow this is so freaking cool I miss writing my Morgans and like their animations have always been so wonky to me like I could never write champs with them because I feel like they're throwing their legs all over the place and it's like how do you keep a straight line you know what I mean okay I think we'll get this one because actually no no I'm not getting this one it's kind of ugly they're all ugly I know I'm never gonna ride these horses I know I won't do that it's just that I want to make sure that they're safe in my home stable and whenever the nostalgia hits I can always hop on these rats, you know what I mean? I don't know what to do. Because I like this one more than the brown one. I mean, I did not just say that. I can't believe I called this horse brown. Dennis, you're not allowed to have a channel anymore. I'm not allowed to ever say anything about horses again. I literally just called a bay horse a brown horse. Okay, I'll just get this one. I'll name it horse. Rat. I'm waiting, Star Stable. I'm waiting for the day when I'll type a rat here and I'll see it pop up as an option. I'll just name this one Spiderweb. Because it's funny. It's really not funny. I just have no name ideas, okay? I'm just. I'm sad like that. I'll just write it now and all my tack is literally gone now. Oh my goodness, these horses are so bad. Okay, no more, no more horses, okay? That was enough, Dennis. You have like four of them, or five, I guess. I'm so embarrassed to talk about this. Oh my goodness, these horses are like unrideable. My game just froze. You know what I really liked about these horses? Like, serious talk now. The fact that they were so dynamic, and I mean, I think they still are one of the most dynamic horses in the game, as in like the way the gallop looks. It looks very like aggressive, like they're so, you know, focused when running. They're like, I'm gonna win this, I'm gonna whoop everyone's ass. And I'm gonna get first place. You know what I mean? Like that's what it feels like when they run. So, so fast. I mean, they're not fast. It seems like they're fast. Oh man, all the memories. Do you see how they're like moving? Like they're spazzing like that? Look at the horse. It's gonna move its legs so weird. Look at that. Like what in the world? But again, it's just the memories. You know what I mean? That's all that matters at this point. Let's go back to my home stable. See all the other ones that I have. And compare them. Man, I haven't played this game in months. Like, I recorded a video last week, or like a few days ago, but I, I just... When the cameras went off, so did the game, you know what I mean? Okay, here are all my quarter horses, I'll put them all here. All the old ones. So I have four of them, and then I have these two, the paints. So we have this one, which is the strawberry roan one. Dude, stop moving like that. And then we have... Moonfighter. I know this the name of this horse was also the name that I had on my previous Star Stable account that got banned when I had this horse. It was also called Moonfighter. So I tried to keep everything. And then my first horse ever in the game was Summer Beauty. Again, I kept the name um, from my old account. I freaking adore this horse, dude. Like, I'm so attached to this horse. It's not even funny. Like, I'm attached to the most hideous horse breed from the game. Well, the knobstrippers and the curly horses are, in my opinion, worse than the old quarter horses, than the generation two quarters. And then I have um, Moon Runner, which is a paint, American paint horse, and then Thunder Eye. And then I have the Epilusa one, the space looking one, which I wish Star Stable would make another, another horse with this coat, because the coat is insanely good. Like, yeah, whatever, the mold is weird, the breed is ugly. But I mean the coat do be hitting the spot, you know what I mean? Okay, I'll take out all the tack from the Hoflinger. I was gonna say Welsh Pony again, if I say that one more time. You know, Star Stable is doing a better job with like horse breeds, animations, everything but the gameplay. The gameplay is just still boring, so I wish they would take their focus more on the gameplay and less on the aesthetics of the game, because the game can be cool. Like, this game was so much more fun in 2015. 2016, 2017, 2018, when we only had these crusty looking horses because the gameplay was more fun. And you know why it was more fun? Because the racing was cool back then. Like, at least we had that. And that's my opinion. The racing was so much better 
they they just ruined the way the horse interacts with the ground now with the elements from the game you can't even get like boost jumps anymore like you can but they're not as effective anymore and i'm like why did you do that that was so freaking unnecessary star stable here we go what while well, I'm riding a freaking ancient horse, what am I expecting? Oh, back to the good old days, dude. Riding these horses. Oh, how I miss those times. I'm getting all nostalgic right now. But for real though. This horse is really ugly, I'm gonna get off of it. Like, it looks really bad. Um, I don't regret buying it, I just, I can't ride it, dude. I cannot do that. It'll just stay in my home stable and I'll just take a glance at you once in a while. Moonfighter. My soul horse. I used to freaking race with that one all the time. I'm gonna miss these horses so much. I mean, I, I got the ones that I wanted. You know, it's funny, I know. It's weird that I like these horses. Like, I'm the most critical person you probably can ever think of when you think of a Star Stable critic. But emotional attachments are something else. They change everything. And I joined this game in 2015 right before the quarters came out, or I think it was after, I'm not sure, it was like a one, two week away situation. And I remember when I was on the starter horse and I would see people run on these horses, I mean gallop, I mean ride these horses, I was like, man, when I get my hands on these guys, I'm gonna never get off them. And that was what happened, you know, I always, I was always riding these horses um, because they were really cool back then, but it starts to believe, well, look at the hooves, oh my goodness, dude. I'm so proud of Star Stable, like the way they just evolved is crazy, dude. I just can't wait for them to change the gameplay experience and make it more fun because people are, you know, leaving the game. The game is dying slowly and they're not. The summer festival is not gonna do it, you know, the freaking whatever they did this month that was so boring. The summer festival at the beach, like I don't, I didn't even check it out. I only went to look at the shops, like these little boring events are not gonna revive the game. We need something massive to change the game, something big, very impactful. Um, I wish it was a racing game. Actually, no, I just wish that, you know, you could do multiple things. If you want to race in this game, then do it and have a really good racing system. If you want to just wander around the map, you can do that too. Like, I still want it to be an open, open world game. I just wish that there were some things you could do to keep you engaged because this game has so much potential. It's the biggest horse game ever and it's my childhood game. I'm not gonna quit this game. All right, everyone. Um, if you wanna follow me on TikTok, at Dennis Y Storm, Instagram, at Dennis Y Storm, really active there. I feel like I'm more active there than I am on YouTube, which is kind of weird. But anyway, um, I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye, everyone.